Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. This is Gizela9000 on YouTube, and I have a guest commentator with me. Introduce yourself. It's your boy KLM4. You know how we do. All right. Today we're playing Dragon Ball Advanced. Yep. For the Game Boy Advance. And okay, already the lag is starting for some reason. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Come on, man, the lag ain't gonna be that bad. Yeah, it's not gonna be that bad. I restarted my computer. See, see what happened? We already recorded this, and, uh, it's, it was really lagging, like, really badly, yes, so. like, like, eager like, wrapped the lag. Like, the game was like, fuck. Yeah, basically. <laughs> my the lag was that bad. All right, so. Once upon a time, deep in the mountains, a great adventure was about to begin. As Goku was working hard as his training, a girl came along. The girl's oh, name oh, was Bulma. Why are you sound like Mr. Bulma? I don't know. She oh, was a cute, strong-willed girl. When Bulma saw the ball that Goku kept as a memor- a mental. Oh. Blah, blah, blah. Fuck it. Not- <laughs> Like, I just messed myself up. Fuck it. As a memento, she made him She made him an odd proposition. It was a beautiful ball that had stars inside it. It was called a Dragon Ball. They were very unusual balls, and when all seven are gathered together, it is said that the Eternal Dragon appears and grants any one wish. Yes. And so, from unexpected beginning, Goku and Bulma went up on a journey together to seek out the remaining Dragon Balls. It has the best honeymoon of all time. And now we're gonna start. See, this is a side-scrolling beat-em-up. Where, right. where you play as Kid Goku. It's set during the, during the time of Dragon Ball. Uh -huh. And Dragon Ball is the, is the prequel to Dragon Ball Z, where Goku is an adult. And uh, this is before, this is set even before Goku learned the Kamehameha. So all Goku has is melee attacks and his power pull. But, um, sorry guys, I, I, I'm really not that fond of Dragon Ball. I like I grew up with Dragon Ball Z. I, I like see. Dragon Ball, unlike this guy. I mean, I mean Dragon Ball was I, but... I, I just can't get into it because I just grew up with Dragon Ball Z and GT. Now, if there's lag, it's because me and Keyshawn are not in the same room. We are using TeamViewer to... So he can see what's so he can see what I'm playing. Like Yeah. I mean we, we I mean me and him was kinda far away. We had like like freaking childhood like friends and, and RL and stuff is like but it's like we is like too far away now. And then sometimes we just don't got money to, to, to see each other and, and otherwise we don't got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that shit. Anyways, now this is a mostly blind let's play. I already did the first level before, like I said, because because the lag was so bad that I we had to restart the recording. Right. Now I have a little bit more better experience with this game because I got kind of far when I was testing this game. Like, like when I first got my um what Game Boy Advance emulator, I was just testing like mad, mad games. Like, wait, Dragon Ball? Like, I just test that out. And then it's like, when I tested it out, I got far, like, close to Piccolo. But yeah, you also get a command made in this game. So you're gonna get it, like, soon or whatever, but, yeah. But I, I know a little bit more than he does in this game, but I'm, I'm still blind in this game, too. Now, as you see, Goku is not wearing his turtle uh, school outfit. This is way before he started training under Master Roshi. Basically, this is Goku when he started out. All he had was hit the minimal training he had from Gohan and the power pole. Like I yep, said. And the blue. Tell you like a blue leg, give me these. Come on, but I just want to get some DVDs. Oh, I fell off the cliff. Oh, he didn't even really fall off the cliff. Oh, that's blue leg. So blue leg. Now, Keyshawn, what is your 
uh, experience with the Game Boy Advance. Man, yo, man, I remember when I was a kid, like, I was like, what, 10, 11 years old, I used to cry, like, I want me the Game Boy Advance, I want me the Game Boy Advance. And there's like, so when I got it, yo, it was like, everything was like heavy, because like, most of the games I had on the Game Boy Advance was like, most of the Pokemon games, and then I had Dragon Ball Transformation, Dragon Ball GT Transformation, and then I also had Final Fight 1, and then I had uh, a couple of fighting games, some RPGs, but yeah, I love the Game Boy Advance, especially the SP that you can charge. Play no mobile batteries at the store. Yeah, I had the uh, the Game Boy Advance SP when I was a kid. Oh, remember the light that was rarely that rarely came out? Yes. That took us like freaking like like obscure now. Indeed. Oh, we got some platforming. Here. Platforming. I love me some platforming games. I hate it, man. I hate it. I hate two D platforms. Yo, yo, tell these people how much I suck at Sonic. Oh, and yeah, he, he's pretty much terrible at, like, Sonic 3. Like, he tried Sonic 3. He had, like, mad, like, game game genie cheats on, right? And he still couldn't make it past uh, Sky Sanctuary Zone. Right. I, I, I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm good at 3D Sonic. I'm just not that good at 2D. That was with a lot yeah, of his life. favorite game is actually Shadow the Hedgehog for the game. Dude. Yes, bro. Yeah, bro. I, I, bro. I, I love some, um, some Sonic. I'm kind of a Sonic fan, but Shadow. It's my Black Hedgehog. There's He's my Higa. <laughs> Let's just pretend he didn't say that. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just pretend I ain't say that. Oh, oh, a cheeseburger! No, you no, just said the double talk. cheeseburger! Oh, yeah! <laughs> he gotta give him double cheeseburger! Damn, damn, damn! <laughs> but get on grocery bag! Sorry, we're obsessed with the with that uh, yeah, oh Songify dad. song. Yo, like, see, it won't go away, like, when, though, like, when we first got our song, yo, we, we just, just kept singing it. it. And we just can't stop singing. I got that junk on my PlayStation. Oh yeah, it's it's a pretty addicting song. Yeah, it is. Auto Tune works wonders. Thank you, T Pain, for perfecting it. Yes. I think it's on stuff like that double cheeseburger. <laughs> oh man. Oh, tell these people how I made you freaking hate freaking Silver Steam. Oh yeah, see, Sonic Generations is one of the greatest Sonic games of all time. But there is this one song on Sonic Generations where it where you're in the white world before you fight Silver. It's an instrumental of Silver's theme, Dreams of an Absolution. And it's the most repetitive and short version of Silver's theme I've ever heard in my life. Yes, and I had that theme song as my guy for, uh, um, for Fantasy Star. And I was playing Fantasy Star, right? And the game, it, it, it just kept looping the song. And, t and, yo, and, and like, Drew was so mad. He's like, but the loop, it's just one little small loop. Oh, yeah. Like, that's all you heard. And, and it's just like, repeats and, re and it's just so repetitive. And Well, oh. back to the actual what's happening on screen. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Let's Goku's let's just taking down some big people, basically. Yeah. Like, these... These are just some basic well, apples. Well, apples. Well, apples just recover health. Right. Yeah, For right. all we know, these are just these are just things that Goku's just finding in the wilderness, and he just wants to fight. Right. Well, he has to eat most of these things, man. Oh yeah, Where's pigs and oh, well, looks like we're at the end of the level. So, um, wait, hang on. 
One second, this might be actually be a boss battle, and we'll actually conclude this after the boss battle, if it is indeed a boss battle. So, let's see this. Help. Yeah, yeah, oh yes, it's a boss battle. Let's, let's do this boss battle, and uh, conclude it. Conclude the part after the boss battle ends. Let's. Yeah, but, you, but you better call Zangief, man. It's a bear. And he's like the bear killer. How? How about handing over that delicious-looking sea turtle? You wouldn't happen to be a bad guy, would you? Huh? Dude, don't tell me you're going to defy me. I'm not giving him over to the likes of you. Insolent brat. That's how you want it. I'll eat you first. He's back! Oh man. <laughs> He's like, only, only you can, can protect, protect Forest Fire. With well, this. this... Oh! Get up and. Okay! Oh! That was a pretty easy box oh, battle. Man. Area clear! Alright. That concludes the part, people. Um, we will see you next time. Yep. All right, Keyshawn, also known as KL Man, give you goodbyes. Bye bye. We'll see y'all next time. All right, now we're testing one more time. Keyshawn, say something and not so long, please. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm making short. This is a test. I'm gonna smack you in the face with a test because of the test, and I'm just leave that because that's the rest, and I'm out of here. That was still too fucking long. You're supposed to just say like testing, testing, one, two, three. <laughs> what the fuck is that shit? That. You, no, you know no. Fuck you <laughs> and your and the horse you fucking rode in on. And we are still fucking recording because I I may put this shit on YouTube as like a fucking outtakes and shit. Fuck you. <laughs>